there's still a lot up in the air right now. The governor has not yet said whether he plans to extend the stay at home order and hasn't really given us an answer on whether kids can actually expect to go back to school, be back in the classroom in the middle of May. But he says those decisions are coming soon. However, priority number one right now is still slowing the spread of the virus. To lift the stay at home order and the restrictions we have in place right now would be catastrophic. And the data tells us this. If we lifted everything right now, it's pretty certain that our hospitals would be overwhelmed, our ICU beds would be overwhelmed. Meantime, because so many people are unexpectedly out of work and trying to file for unemployment, the governor is putting pressure on the Division of Employment Security to get that money out. Not only will that help to save families, it's going to help our economy because that's one of the best ways to keep our economy going is to get money back into it. And they're going to keep working hard and I'm going to keep pushing them until we get this thing working perfectly. He says in the time that typically 9,000 claims would be filed, he says more than 500,000 North Carolinians have filed for unemployment.